Alrighty, here is one of those crazy named knives off of Amazon. Obviously, you know, from China. The Care Care So Love G10 Small Folding Tiny Pocket Knife. And there's a little Chinese in case you can read it. Care so love whatever but here it is it's like 10 bucks on Amazon it is G10 and in the Amazon picture they show this entire logo here across the actual knife and I was really worried that that was going to be imprinted on here Thank God it wasn't, because I wouldn't have liked that very much. But what you got is a little keychain knife. Let me show you against something that you may, here's like a little fine screwdriver. And as a matter of fact, this happens to be a T6. And everything's nice and tight. This is T6 hardware. All right, this is a slip joint. A little slip joint pocket knife to hang on your keys. And that can be for a slotted screwdriver. Also, right there. It's supposedly D2 steel. You can see how small it is. About as big as my finger. And oh, it's very sharp. Let me get a piece of paper and see how sharp it is. Well, do I have a piece of paper? I've got a little bag here from CVS Pharmacy. Wow. This might actually be. Real D2 steel. Let's see. That's pretty sharp, folks. So, the grind, it's a little wonky. But, uh, come oiled. It's got some oil. Like I said, everything's tight. It's very grippy. It's real G10. It's just not plastic. And it's a perfect little keychain knife. That's what I was looking for. And it is a whopping 10 bucks on Amazon. 10 bucks. So, here it is. It's sitting on my keys. There it is. Hanging right on there. Just for a little box opener, stuff like that. So... This will be on my Amazon Tools of the Trade page in which I have all my recommended products. There'll be a link in the video description below. If you're looking for a little keychain knife, you know what I use these for? I use these most of the time to get dirt from underneath my fingernails, to tell you the truth. I mean, that's basically... What I use them for, it's sharp enough that I don't have to sharpen it. They're proud of the fact that it's D2 steel. Can we believe that? Well, that's to be determined. No other branding on it whatsoever. But I saw this and I saw a bunch of others. And I always liked the feel of real G10 and what it is, it's a slip joint, and it's very positive. There you go. And then it's super snappy. Well, as a matter of fact, I tightened it up, so now it's not that snappy. Let me back it off just a hair. And let's see if it's... There you go. You can hear the walk and talk. Listen for the walk and talk.
There you go. See, I was testing it, and I gave that a little bit of a turn, so I, I tightened it up too much. So that's just one of the little Amazon finds that I found while perusing around. And like I said, I added this to my Amazon Tools of the Trade page. The link will be in the description below. It helps support this YouTube channel, Captain Dave Sport Fishing and Quality Knife Sharpening. So not bad for 10 bucks. You probably couldn't even find anything like as this good at at Walmart or anything else or even even a knife store. So let's take a look at the other one. That's literally on my keychain. Yep, still got the walk and talk. The uh, looks like they're pretty hand ground to me. Well, they do a little more grinding on this side than on this side. So I guess it's machine or something. But either way, I thought I'd pass this on. There's no other videos on YouTube by this name. There could be 50 other names, but not by this name. So that is the Amazon find of the week. Thanks for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you kind of enjoy this little show and tell. I don't do a lot of videos where it's the talking hands, but in a little video like this, that's about all you need. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.